Dennis Warren. What me? Keep it going with Tommy. I'm just doing a good job up here holding that. I'm the eye candy for the evening. Thank you. And one of those nights you walk into a comedy club and you just know you've got it going on, man. I one of those nights. You gotta be careful being the eye candy, you'll end up paying the child support like I do. I paid child support so long, my ex's nickname for me is Plaintiff. <laughs> <laughs> That's better than my son's nickname for me. His nickname for me is Paycheck. <laughs> yeah, when I first met my wife, I thought I found a trophy wife. After a year of marriage, I figured out it was just a participation trophy. <laughs> I used to be the breadwinner, and now I just work for peanuts. <laughs> Went to the dollar store the other day. I had to borrow money for my parents to go. <laughs> my ex takes our son out for ice cream. I gotta stay home with him for ice cubes. <laughs> I asked my ex when I could see our son again. She said, after the check clears. <laughs> Random Max's boyfriend, I said, what do you do for work? He said, cash your check. <laughs> oh. <laughs> All right, it's tough, man. Tough paying the child support, but I've done something to combat the child support. I've taken on a new identity. I am now the child support superhero, yeah. I'm kind of like the reverse Superman, you know? Superman's got a big red ass in his chest, right? <laughs> yeah, I got a dollar sign, baby, yeah. Superman wears knee-high red leather boots. All I can afford is a pair of flip-flops. Superman's got a long red cape. I got an old beach towel with holes in it. <laughs> Superman can leap tall buildings in a single bound. With the money I paid my ex, she can purchase the tall building Superman leaps over. <laughs> Superman's faster than a speeding bullet. The state of Massachusetts give my ex money for my paycheck faster than the speed of light. <laughs> Superman's stronger than a locomotive. After my divorce, I walked out of court feeling like I had been hit by a locomotive. <laughs> but this is what I do as the child support superhero, okay? I put on my costume, and then I go down to the mall around midnight, one o'clock in the morning, right? Then I scan the parking lot with my x-ray vision until I see a car with a young couple making out inside of it. I slowly oh sneak up to the car. I slide along the car up to the driver's side window. I break the window. I throw a package of condoms on the front seat. Then I go running down the street screaming, You'll thank me later! Thank you. Funny part about it is it's all over the newspapers that I'm doing it, but nobody really gives a shit because anybody who bothers to stop and read the article is someone who pays child support to a bitch just like me. <laughs> Used to piss me off, but I'm past it now. <laughs> yeah, I'm really freaking past it. But then I got a part-time job because I pay the child support. That's a Chippendale dancer. <laughs> well, I'm big guy night, obviously. But no, you'd be surprised. Some girls like the big guys, you know? Any girls like big guys? I'll see you right after the show. <laughs> and what the rest of you won't give me, the internet will. You think I'm getting? I get these girls that come all the time, they want to live out their big guy fantasy through me. How do you think that makes me feel? Good. Pretty good, man. <laughs> I get requests, though. I get like weird ass requests, man. I get these girls that come to me like, okay, here's what I want. Here's what I want, okay? I want to be Princess Leia in a bikini outfit, and I want you to be Jabba the Hutt. <laughs> I got other requests. I get weird ass requests. Now. I get these girls that come up to me. They go, okay, here's what I want. I want to be a little girl sitting on your knee, and I want you to be Santa Claus. I want Santa to give me a gift that's 12 inches and it'll make me feel like a naughty girl. I don't think you've been that good a girl this year. Why don't you ask Santa for a little smaller gift? 
Let me tell you something, ladies. Once you go big, that's what you'll dig. <laughs> Once you've had fluff, a regular man's just not enough. <laughs> ladies, if you're in need of a dollar dance, why settle half man? You can make that a chance. <laughs> hey, my mother is full blooded Canadian. I'm from America, but it's been my honor to play Yuck Yuck some dance for me.